it's a very phenomenal video my two decades of experience has been condensed in this video so i urge everybody to watch this video till the end and get all those seven things in you today you may not be an entrepreneur today but if you develop this seven mindset trace you will be successful in whatever you're doing today plus you will be a successful entrepreneur whenever you choose to do so If you go to college students and if you do a survey of how many people want to become entrepreneurs, you will be surprised with the wide majority of people who want to become entrepreneurs. It may be because entrepreneurship is hyped also, it is being projected as something huge, something phenomenal, something big. But if before you can become an entrepreneur, you need to begin creating the mindset of an entrepreneur. Please understand this very, very carefully. Everything in life begins here. Whatever you want to achieve in life, you should start first here. So if you want to become an entrepreneur, there are seven essential mindset traits that every big and successful entrepreneur has. So before you get on your entrepreneurship journey, if you can start developing them, you will definitely win in life and you will become a very successful entrepreneur. Hi, this is your friend Deepak Bajaj and today we're going to discuss seven absolutely essential mindset traits of successful entrepreneurs and i have got these seven essential traits based on my experience of last two decades so working with 17 lakh plus people so listen to this video very carefully and understand all these seven traits very carefully number one ability to stay positive in all situations you can call it part of job description whatever keeps happening with you you will make plans plans will fail you will expect few things and those expectations will fail. You will, uh, you will ask for some particular results and those results will disappoint you. Whatever may happen, you need to stay calm and stay positive in all situations. And if you want to say it like this, this is part of job description. Being optimistic, being positive, this is part of your job description. It will work out, not a problem. It will work out, not a problem. It will work out, not a problem. And being an entrepreneur myself for the last 15 years, I can give you one tip if you want to stay positive in all situations. Whatever happens to you, just ask yourself, okay, now this has happened. What next? What next? What can I do now? 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 And that will help you stay positive in all situations and not only just positive, but it will help you give more solutions also. Second thing that every entrepreneur needs in life is you need to be flexible on strategies and plans. You need to be flexible on strategies and plans. There are two things I'll tell you on this, which I learned from my coach. So every time I went to Tony Robbins, I got this from him. He said, Deepak, when you make a plan and then when you start working for that plan, if your plan doesn't work, never change the plan, change what you are doing. The second thing that is absolutely essential for every entrepreneur is to have the flexibility on strategies and plan. Be flexible on strategies and plan. This is absolutely, absolutely essential. Whatever plan you make, they are bound to fail. Whatever results you work for, you will not get that result. Something will happen that will disappoint you. Something will happen that will not go the way that you have originally planned. So what do you need to do in those situations? There are two things which I have learned from my coach and I'll quickly share with you. Every single time I went to my coach Tony Robbins, he told me this. Deepak, every time you set a goal and you work for a goal and if you're not able to achieve that goal, never change the goal, change what you are doing. So anytime you are going towards a goal and things don't work out the way you planned them to work out, never change the goal, change what you are doing. And number two, work with this attitude. Either I'll find a way or I'll make a way. Either I'll find a way or I will make a way. But stay flexible on your strategies and plans. Third mindset trait of every entrepreneur, curious to learn, curious to learn. Entrepreneurship is not a destination, my friends. Entrepreneurship is a journey. Remember this. Entrepreneurship is not a destination. It's a journey. Once I was there in Mumbai with Jack Canfield and Jack Canfield told something really phenomenal. He said, Deepak, whenever you set a goal, 
and you work for achieving that goal and you achieve that goal it doesn't matter what you achieve what matters is what you become in the process of achieving that goal so please understand this very important point you need to be constantly willing to learn new things the game is not how much money you make my friend the game is after one year after two years can you become a totally different person as a result of following your entrepreneurship pursuit so that is very important and that can happen only when you are curious to learn so stay curious to learn fourth thing every entrepreneur has in their mindset is undying persuasion undying persuasion what is persuasion you have an idea you want to build a team and you want a world to agree to that idea you want everybody around you to con to be convinced with that idea so you need to convince people to your idea sometimes you need to convince them to buy your product sometimes you need to convince them to become your partner sometimes you need to convince them to join your team sometimes you need to convince government agencies to give you some licenses or some grants every single day an entrepreneur is on only one job that is pursuing pursuing persuasion so you need to have that spirit of undying persuasion you will try one way second way third way fourth way but till the time you get to a yes you will continuously work on persuading people to your ideas right so you need to have undying persuasion it's a very phenomenal video my two decades of experience has been condensed in this video so i urge everybody to watch this video till the end and get all those seven things in you today you may not be an entrepreneur today but if you develop this seven mindset traits you will be successful in whatever you're doing today plus you will be a successful entrepreneur whenever you choose to do so fifth thing every entrepreneur has is absolute ownership of everything they do and everything that happens to them right so absolute ownership so remember this word total absolute ownership total absolute ownership if things are working out who is responsible you are responsible if things are not working out, who is responsible? Again, you are responsible. Whatever happens in your company, whatever happens with you, you are the one person who is responsible for everything that is happening with you. You need to take absolute ownership. And when you take absolute ownership, you need to have this no EBC rule. No EBC. E means excuses. So no excuses. B means blame. No blame. And third is C. C is complaint. No excuse, no blame, no complaint. And that means absolute ownership sixth one this is my favorite and i have been teaching this to all affiliate marketers direct sellers network marketers and everybody who is trying to build a business along with their jobs or profession so listen to this very carefully entrepreneurs don't wait for work they create work so if you want to wait for work and then this is an employee trade that somebody will come and give you a task somebody will come and give you a task you need to continuously improve can you need you need to continuously create more work for you i mean that's very simple in every business this works many times people ask me what was my working schedule and what was my strategy uh, in any business that i entered or how i built a huge direct selling business empire in a record time I always tell them one thing, create more work than you can handle, build more legs than you can handle, build a bigger team than you can handle. Then you slowly start developing it, right? And you need to create work for yourself, my friend. Nobody will come and give you work. And seventh and last one, an entrepreneur knows it, believes it, that a team is always better than an individual. Very simple. A team is always better than an individual. I was with John C. Maxwell. He's a leadership expert from America. And John C. Maxwell told me one simple thing, phenomenal thing. And he said, the bigger the dream, more important is the team. The bigger the dream, more important is the team. So a team is always better than individual. So throw away this idea that you can do everything by yourself. Throw this idea away. A team is always better than an individual. Work with that plan and I'm sure you will shine. So there are seven mindset traits that I've just discussed with you that every entrepreneur needs to develop. Even if you're a student today, even if you are working in a job today, even if you are a professional, start developing these seven traits and you will get immense promotion in whatever you're doing in life. I have one dream. I want to see you at the top, right? Keep shining, keep sparkling and let's make this world a better place together. Love you guys.